Over the weekend, I went out to get my wife an anniversary gift. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go to Josie and just see what they have. I went there and I looked through a whole freaking lot of it as well. And they didn't have a lot of the new stuff that I wanted, Waxahachie, uh, Beth Gibbons. Then after that, I went to the just general new arrivals section. They don't really have indie stuff in here, but they do have a little subsection for punk and new wave and I found two things there. Check this out. The first one that I picked up is Revolution Girl Style Now. This is the debut album from 1991 from Bikini Kill. Bikini Kill of course is Kathleen Hanna who she, she launched a whole Riot Girl thing right. I just finished listening to her book Rebel Girl and it is phenomenal. She talks about the scene quite extensively. She talks a bit about, obviously it's feminism, men, and guys, we can do better. It's, it's just truly a phenomenal, phenomenal audiobook. And you can get a physical book as well, of course. But Revolution Girl Style Now by Bikini Kill, 1991. Now this was originally released on cassette I can't remember if they uh, if she said it was released on K or Kill Rock Stars. It was one of those out of Olympia. They didn't give it a vinyl or CD pressing until 2015, and so this is that one. I'm I'm curious to dig in and um, explore this album because that 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 book is really really good. I strongly recommend it. She also talks about post Bikini Kill stuff like La Tigra and the Julie Ruin uh, and stuff like that. So strong recommend on both of those. Links in the description if I can find them to where you can get those as well. Um, the next one that I picked up is Buzzcocks, A Different Kind of Tension. This is actually the, um, I believe it's the 1980 pressing per Discogs. It's the only one that has the T3 in the Matrix runout. This is their third album. They only really released three full studio albums before a very long break. And this is the third one. I have given this one a listen. And I have to say the ones that I really, really liked uh, most on this album were Hollow Inside and um, I believe it was a different kind of tension, the, the title track. I need to explore this album further. I'm kind of looking for some stuff about this band that I can work into an album store. I have one other from them, Singles Going Steady, obviously. So um, has their kind of great stuff on that. Legendary punk band, legendary Riot Girl band. I got those for, this one was 19, this one was 17, so that plus Josie has this thing where if you were part of their like, I don't know, membership or something like that, if you spend so much money, then you get like a, a free item. So I got this one for free, 19 bucks off the order. So I basically paid after tax about 18 and some change. So nine bucks for each LP. Not too shabby. You know anything about either of these bands that you think might be a fun one to just kind of throw together an album story on? I'm doing those weekly. Let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.